In this tutorial, we will teach you how to use scenarios in formulas in Excel. Over here we have the loan amount to be borrowed, the interest rate, and the years to pay off. We can use this data and create different scenarios. For example, a scenario where we borrow more money than the amount needed, or a scenario where we borrow less. For that, go to the Data tab and click on the What If Analysis button. From the drop-down menu, select the Scenario Manager option. Once the new window opens up, click on the Add button and name the scenario. In the Changing Cells area, we will select the three values in the sheet that make up the whole calculation. You can add comments over here as well. Once done, click on the OK button to go to the next step. Since in this scenario the amount borrowed is less, so we will assume that the interest charged will be higher and the repayment term will be less. Now click on the Add button to add another scenario. This time we will borrow more, so the interest charged may be lower than 5%, and the time to repay will increase. After you are done, click on the OK button, and all the scenarios which we added will appear on the left side of the Scenario Manager window. For this tutorial, we have made three scenarios. When you double-click on any one of them, the results will change in the sheet. You can get a summary of it as well. For that, just click on the Summary button and choose Scenario Summary for the report type. With that done, click on OK, and a new sheet will be added to your workbook that you can print as well.